All right, real quick, showcase a smart play by the CPU, Minnesota Vikings, Brett Favre, and take a look. All right, now we're going to break this down real quick, real quick, try to keep this video short. So let's take a look at from this angle. Look at what Brett Favre is looking at. Backs out. Well, in a minute. Okay, backs out. As you can see, he's looking to the right. And there's great coverage over there. Be you know what? Let me go over here. See, now this is beautiful. This is beautiful. This is what I was talking about on a few of my videos before. I'm not going to spend a lot of time on this, but look how he stays in his back pedal, man. And he's playing him. He's playing him face up. He's looking at the receiver and occasionally he looks over, looks over at the quarterback. Look at that. That is how you're supposed to play the receive. That's how you play it, man. Like I said, I play in the secondary. You know, I know everybody has different techniques, but that is how you play it. Look at how he's playing it. Now, some people might say, oh, yeah, well, the route is shorter. Because the other video I showed, I think it was a streak or something like that. But that's how you play. Keep him in front of you. Now, anyway, let's do this real quick. I got to hurry up here. I got something to do real quick. So he makes his decision. It's Adrian Peterson. Very smart check down right here. Boom. Nice play. Only thing I don't like, Adrian Peterson should have scored here. Why is it that he goes into, a, you know, why is he trying to overpower his guy right here? No need for that. He has the block. All he would need to do is run to the left. He's in the end zone. So, you know, player AI needs to be touched up. I've mentioned that a million times. But this is a clear reason as to why. All right. Pretty good play by the CPU overall. Let me know what you think. Nice tackle there at the end.